And the reason for concentric diversification is that often now and then, Nigerians keep saying that the Nigerian economy is not diversified. That is absolutely incorrect. The Nigerian economy is diversified. The problem with our diversification is that it is not concentric. We keep saying that Nigeria is a, a mono-dependent economy. Yes, it was some years ago when oil was contributing about 70 to 80 percent of revenue and about 95 percent of our foreign exchange. But today, the non-oil sector is contributing about 55 percent, which is higher than the contribution of oil to national revenue. However, the oil sector's contribution to foreign exchange is still very high. And that is why with this 8%, 8.9% contribution of, uh, to GDP, any little change in the oil sector has a huge effect on the economy. Agriculture currently contributes about 24% of GDP. Uh, the digital economy is growing very fast and is contributing higher than, than oil. So if that is the case, we cannot say that the Nigerian economy is not diversified. But what we are lacking is that even in the oil sector, the oil sector itself is not diversified. And that's why we need to begin to talk about concentric uh, diversification. Because it is not only to produce the crude, but we have to process the crude. That's in the refinery. You have to go to petrochemicals. You begin to have uh, raw materials to serve the other industries. And in that way, we are able to earn more foreign exchange. If we able come to agriculture, that is contributing about 24% to GDP, we are not processing our products. We are selling them raw. And because there is no value addition, we are not earning foreign exchange from it. And that is why we are saying in all sectors, we need to work on our product complexity so that we are able to process whatever it is that we, we produce to a world-class standard that others will be willing to buy. Even if it's only within the African continent, we would be earning the much-needed uh, foreign exchange.